I make that joke again. The one about square CD ROMs? Yeah. Hi, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, everybody. <laughs> and welcome, welcome to this new game uh, that I have temporarily forgotten the name of it. Uh, JB Herald Murder Club. Oh, right. Let's, yeah, oh, it's I at the top to of the screen. This. All right. Uh, I think this is the run button. Okay. Just a moment. Murder Club. Club. TM. Bill Robbins. Sex male. Age 34 years old. Okay. Oh no, he's Cause dead. Death. Excessive death. <laughs> <laughs> cause he's either dead or very dinger. Repeated stabbing. Stabbing. Oh, okay. So, cause of death. Stabs. Yeah, you could have made that steps. much simpler. Uh huh. Uh huh. Ooh. Oh wow. Smooth and jazzy. S smooth and jazzy. I went, is that JB Harold? Is that Bill Robbins? I I don't, I don't know. I wish you'd kind of stop looking. Okay, there we go. Oh my God. Nope. Wait, but <laughs> he's we looking at a guy. He's looking at a guy oh, loading no. a gun. Oh, I no. see okay. you with that gun. <laughs> oh no! The slightly part on the top of the gun is sliding back. Hey that buddy, you're away. holding that gun kind of weird. <laughs> oh. Never mind, I'm gone now. I'm leaving. I'm not putting up with a guy who holds a handgun like that. I've got a very important meeting of the J.D. Harold Murder Club. <laughs> Starring Star this pistol. <laughs> oh, the JB Harold oh. Club stars JB Harold. Are we supposed to know who that is? I thought it was a made up guy. I'm pretty sure it's a made up guy. Wow, look at that asshole. <laughs> <laughs> this is already the best game we've ever played. Maybe. <laughs> nah, not. <laughs> That's probably Ham Ham Heartbreak. Yeah, it's we're gonna have to land a pretty good game to beat Ham Ham Heartbreak. Mm -hmm. Her legs went all the way up to the title bar. <laughs> Jad Gregory. Jad. Gregory. Jad. Wow. Jad. That's a Star Wars name. <laughs> Oh, we got the the bright yellow uh, Dick Tracy outfit. Uh huh. Uh huh. And see McMahon as himself. <laughs> yeah. Oh, D. Anderson's head is elongated. Andy Sanders. <laughs> Andy Hamburg. <laughs> Adam Sandler. <laughs> Cheap dollar store knockoff Jack Nicholson in Chinatown. Uh huh, uh huh. Those cars were too sexy to be shown on screen. <laughs> Murder Club! Oh. It's my favorite sandwich. <laughs> This alley's too narrow. <laughs> this game's really going all in for the TV style intro. Yeah, right? So s someone got their lower leg shut off and was about to have the other one gone, too. Oh, no! I'm waiting for that hat to get shot off. <laughs> yeah, it's just a big montage of hats being shot off here. <laughs> Watch it. Oh! <gasps> oh, Gasp! man! JB's I hope he does okay. case. Yeah! Boy, this is like that, that time in Phoenix Wright when it was Phoenix Wright's first case. <laughs> you mean like every Phoenix Wright game and they have to contrive every time how it could possibly be his first his case first again? Case. 
Yeah. What circumstances can we invent that require the judge and everyone to tell Phoenix how <laughs> proceedings work again? Uh-huh, uh-huh. We've already done amnesia, like, twice. Yeah. We'll have to come up with something else. Like, double amnesia! <laughs> Uh, uh, are we playing now? Uh, uh, <laughs> What's happened? I haven't pushed anything. Found. Oh! 8.05 a.m. on the 9th. Location. The parking lot near the back entrance of Hoolington College, a suburb of Liberty. Victim. Bill Robbins. 34. President of Robbins Trading Company Limited. Oh, man. I hate oh, when people yeah. are younger than he me. He should have been 31. Oh, yeah? Yeah, because then, then the, uh, he would have started his ice cream franchise on the same. <laughs> 1 a.m. on the 8th. Thorough investigation is being conducted. Eh, kinda. <laughs> They're talking about us, aren't they? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Oh, we're very thorough. Hi, who are, who are you? Yep. Okay. Any one can solve this case. You're the You're one. You're the one, says <laughs> Catherine with a smile. Thanks, Catherine. Oh, okay. Uh, Alright, well, one thing I wanted to do is turn the voices on. Mm -hmm. So I need to figure out how to do that. Okay. I'm into this music. You're gonna have to bear with us, everybody, while we figure out, while while I figure out the controls. Here's a gun and some bullets, Jenny. Yeah. Is that a VHS tape? What else is under there? I think that's a box of bullets. A box of bullets. Okay. Here we go. Narration. Narration. Ooh, do we want the Japanese, Japanese voices or the, or the English, English voices? Man. I mean, I turn things on Japanese whenever possible, but it's up to you. Well, let's, uh... Why don't we alternate per episode? Okay. We'll start with English. English. I think I... I think that's what I did. Did it... I have no idea which button okay. is yes and which button is cancel. <laughs> cool. I think... I think that did it. I think, I think okay. that was correct. So now, investigation. Okay. No one but yep. Anyway, be thorough. Make as many contacts as possible. Is that That's Jack Gregory things. telling us that? I think so. Wait, wasn't Jack Gregory the actor? Oh. Yeah, I'm so confused by this. Maybe that was. Maybe oh maybe, maybe they maybe they went so all in on the TV show opening that. Those, those were the character names, not yeah. actor names. Not the, mm -hmm, because mm -hmm. as though the characters were the actors on the show. Do you so, know what I mean? Yeah. Yes. Which doesn't make a lot of sense if you think about it. No, not so I'm really. Gonna any not at to all. think about it. Uh, yeah. Oh, continue. I think is what I want. Here you we go. You mean to tell me that you don't know who the murderer is yet? I just got here, <laughs> boss. <laughs> this pace, people are going to lose confidence in it. I just started! <laughs> there are going to be angry folks knocking down our doors. Come on! <laughs> Alright, uh... I guess we should do something. Uh, yeah. What do we got? Record form. room? Okay, yeah. There's got to be something in here. Or it wouldn't smell so musty. <laughs> Look record. Uh, unsolved case. Ooh, yikes. The rape at the Downs Hill Cemetery. On April 23rd, 1983, at approximately 2.30 in the morning, a Ms. Sarah Shield, age 21, was beaten and raped by an unknown Ooh. assailant near the Downs Hill Cemetery. That's a bit of a downer to start on. When a security yeah. guard making his rounds came by. His shield was found lying on the ground, unconscious, with severe wounds to her face and face. Well, I... Ms. Shields could not give a description of her attacker, as he was never identified. I wonder if that's going to turn out to be relevant, or just a bit of gruesomeness yeah. for no reason. Okay, how do I... Sure. 
Let me out. Okay. Uh, what else do we have? Stolen goods. Stolen goods. Oh, I think... I think that's stolen goods that maybe had to do with... We need, we need like... We need the thing that tells us the actual details of the case. I'm worried about case, you. Yeah. And I know that somewhere, but I don't know where. <laughs> Uh, wow, what even? Uh, uh, I, I have no idea what oh, that is. Oh, is this our giant board on the wall? I think that's, yeah, pieces? I think that's a giant yeah. board on the wall. That's really good that we have one of those. Message? Oh, well, no, that has to stay English. Yeah, uh, yeah. I guess continue. Hey, Harold. <laughs> you intend to spend the rest of your life working on this case? Hurry up, will He'll you? listen to that what chuckle in his voice. We got yeah. a lot of things to do in case you haven't noticed. <laughs> Leave me alone, skinny head. Who even are you? Do you even work here? <laughs> I don't even know what the case is. The guy got stabbed. A lot. What do we got? Can I get like a menu or something? Uh, this thing only has two buttons. Okay, here we go. Hungry Fisherman! The Holdings! I, I really feel like we've missed something. <laughs> yeah, me too. Can I help you? Uh, that depends. Who the hell are you? Where do you get your hair cut? <laughs> Hello? Have you taken over the case, Mr. Harold? I guess? <laughs> what is your... My blood type is... Mm. Mm, mm, I see, I see. Should we be writing this Fred down? <laughs> yeah, my maybe. Died, his wife, Janet, went to stay with her parents. I'm house-sitting for her. I'm 30 years old. I work for the HH company. My blood type All is right. A. I already okay. asked you that. My father, Edward. My late brother, Billy. My sister, Kate. My brother-in-law, Michael Holding. And Pamela, our housekeeper, who is just like family to us. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. My father, Edward. My late brother Billy, my sister Kate, my brother. Dang it! Okay. Uh, what is your hobby? Hobby. I like to play tennis. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm an expert marksman. At uh -huh. tennis. <laughs> <laughs> what is your native sure. place? <laughs> I was born here in this town. All right. I belong to what the White Park. What is your organization? All right. Okay. Why so not, but... is any of that useful at all? Okay. Oh I god, there's so much. There's a lot. I can't believe he's really dead. I guess it just hasn't sunk in yet. Why would anyone do this? I was hoping you could tell me. <laughs> yeah. And we could close this thing up quick. Yeah. What about? <laughs> All right, well. Okay. Uh, what's your alibi, Mr. Night Expert happened, Marksman? I went out to a movie. It ended about 11 and I went right home. What theater? It was the Gaslight Theater. Oh, I see. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. uh -huh. A likely story. Yeah. I don't know why you think I wasn't at a theater. <laughs> I've been at a theater this whole time. <laughs> I'm at a theater right theater now. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to have to content warning this video so hard. <laughs> oh, now we can go to the Gaslight Theater? That's cool. Owlington College. There's... I... <laughs> Where do we go to get just an explanation of any... 
Like, I, I feel like we need a briefing of some kind. Yeah, yep, yes, yeah. That would have been... Sir. Oh, that just makes those things flash, I guess. Um... The oh no, the police is us. We can't even ask them for help. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, what? <laughs> what? Did Catherine just say a bad word? I don't. It definitely beeped. Huh. What do you want now, Harold? You know you have to go through proper police <laughs> procedures. Can, can you tell me what they are, please? <laughs> How do we detective? I understand. I'm going to give you a search warrant. You had better not make me sore. You hear me, Harold? <laughs> oh, yes. I've already issued oh. a search warrant. <laughs> I don't know how it works. <laughs> How's the investigation going? You know, you're the one guy who can solve this case without all shit breaking loose. Catherine's... She totally did! She, totally she said swear. all shit breaking loose! Yeah. Gosh. Thanks, yeah. Catherine's sassy. Her job in this office is to wear a sweater. Any new lead? Show me what you found. I have no idea. Oh, is this our forensics guy? I guess so, yeah. He's wearing a white coat. Harold, you can talk all you want, but you haven't shown me anything concrete. Oh, if he wants concrete, you could get him some concrete. How's the investigation oh, coming geez. along? Well Do we do identification yet? I think that's where we just were. Okay. Presumably this is not going to be useful. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, change of music. Yeah, who's now. even in there? Yeah. I confess! <laughs> I did it! Please don't make me be a detective anymore! <laughs> I'm worried about you burning out. Okay. Well, we have a search warrant now, so we can... Yeah, we can go we search Baskin Robbins out. house. Yeah, that's a detective thing to do. Yeah. Please come in. Thanks! Thanks! Oh yeah, searching the premises. Uh, there. Oh, I'm already okay. in the red living room. All right. Okay. Gonna search the bedroom. It's cozy. Oh, so he and his wife slept in uh, twin beds, a la Robin Laura Petrie. Oh yeah. Let's see if it's okay. earrings. Take them. Take them. Yeah, I think we just take everything, right? Yeah. I mean. Yeah. I would think so. Yeah, I would think so, too. That's how video game. Alright, in the study. Hey, That's that a nice chair. That is a pretty good chair. We should take it. Ugh. Oh. Oh, but I want the chair. Oh. The chair is good. Right. Catherine would like that chair, I think. Uh, suspicious already. Nothing on the shelves. What did they eat? Can you? What did they eat? Do you know what's going on at all? It's a horse riding club. Mm, mm hmm. Earrings? They must be Janet. Who is Janet? This is the first I've heard of it. <laughs> Janet's, uh, <laughs> Janet's Billy's wife. Oh, really? How did you yeah. know that? <laughs> I was paying attention. Gosh. <laughs> since the murder, she's been staying with her parents, the Carrington. Her parents the say Carrington. she's in bad shape. She doesn't eat, doesn't sleep. They're really worried about her. Oops, Ever since dang the it. murder, she's been staying with her parents, the Carrington. Okay. Uh, should we know who any of these people are? Who's Edward Rand? My father is uh, totally okay. absorbed in his work. The dad. He cares okay. more about the Robbins Trading Company than anything. Including his family. Wait, 
My so, father is. Somebody's so, got to trade those robins. So who's Bill? Can't the dead guy. Really dead. Right, but what's Bill to this guy? Is this his brother? His brother. Okay. It's his brother. I'm gonna be really <laughs> bad at this. <laughs> okay. That's okay. Like, usually I'm down with a mystery, but I guess, like, just not having a briefing at the beginning just leaves me utterly baffled. <laughs> Alright, uh... So we got... Okay, HH Company is where that dude worked. Works. Mm -hmm. There's... We could go to the Gaslight Theater to investigate his alibi. We could go to the Carringtons to talk to Janet. Who uh, is... We could go Who's Who E. Robbins? The dead guy's wife. Huh? Okay. Who's E. Robbins? E. Robbins! That's the dad. Okay. Edward. Edward, okay. Yeah. Who is it? What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Don't just stand there smoking that stinking cigarette. Go out and find the murderer. Pamela Oh, she's the housekeeper. Ah. I just really like that for some reason. I'm 55 years old. I'm not sure about that. I'm the housekeeper. My blood type is O. The robins are my family. I tell fortune. <laughs> oh. I can see you're skeptical, but just a month ago, the cards told me that something terrible would happen to you. <laughs> what do you think of that? <laughs> <laughs> I drew the death card and the six of knives and yeah, yeah. the dead ice cream man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a qualified new one. Huh. Huh. Okay. I'm from men. No, I don't belong to England. Alright. Uh, 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 <laughs> A terrible, dreadful thing. Can you imagine the pain his father must be going through? Imagine the pain I'm going through. You don't believe in men like Mr. Robbins. I always told the children they were lucky to have such a fine father. Okay, so is Fred the brother? Uh, yeah. Okay. Mm. So that's why you murdered Bill! <laughs> Who is Kate holding? I think that's Fred's sister-in-law or something? No, Janet's Fred's sister-in-law, right? Oh, yeah. I was thinking Fred's wife's sister, maybe. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, I have to get a warrant before I can search the house. I don't even know where he died, or, how, or where his body is, or anything. <laughs> mm hmm Robin's company. Maybe he was killed. Okay. Maybe he was killed in his office or something. Okay. How can I help you? <laughs> <laughs> you can You're already helping me. <laughs> yeah. Just by being alive. If it's about the deceased CEO, you should ask the president. He's in the back room. Please step this way. If I could step that way, I wouldn't <laughs> need to see the president. <laughs> Hello. Hello. What is it? <laughs> what is it? It's a greeting that people say to each other in English. Edward Robbins. Oh, you're the dad. Yep. 60 years old. President of the Robbins Trading Company. Blood type, I don't remember. 
It rarely comes up in conversation. What? <laughs> what kind of conversations are you having? My <laughs> Bill and Fred and my oh, daughter Kate. Oh, the Kate. Okay, she has a different name because she's married. Oh, she's Gordon married. Is my oh, okay. Hobby. I have a private pilot's license with over 4,000 oh. hours of flight time. <laughs> Good for you. In the same plane. I was born and raised here. In this in office. office. <laughs> I'm the managing director of the local branch of the Chamber of Commerce. Uh, okay. Uh, that night, I went to my friend. I James forgot to ask Bain the Bain housekeeper. I came home around house. 11 yeah. and went straight to bed. No, nothing. Please catch whoever did it. You I ever hear of a guy named Bill Robbins? Anymore. If it has to do with Bill's work, <laughs> ask his secretary, Shelley McDonald. around. No one else around. Okay. Oh, I missed the guy who showed us in, though. Hit the trail. Okay. Uh, yeah, I guess we can go ask at the theater about Fred's alibi, although it's, I feel like... They're gonna be, uh, yeah, we totally remember yeah. everybody who do comes you, to Do the... you remember Fred Robbins was here the other night? So I, don't, I don't know if we want to ask the uh, Gaslight Theater for information on anything, because they'll just be like, oh yeah, you were here too. <laughs> don't you remember? Are you feeling okay? She did it. <laughs> Who's Nick? Do you like these earrings? Oh, I wear earrings. Well, no, I wasn't asking you about earrings in general. <laughs> Uh, okay. Hey. Let's, uh, I guess... Oh, give me back. Hi, JP. How's the investigation going? You know, you're the one guy who can solve this case without all f breaking loose. <laughs> without all f breaking loose. <laughs> yep. Not all ass breaking loose. <laughs> well, Harold, are you making any progress at all? Yeah. And they're like the fool <laughs> Maybe. The case. Whoa! Wow. Did he totally just say solve the fucking totally. case? I think he did. I think he did. All right. Uh, give me your Come ovens. On, Harold, you're jumping the gun. Oh. You don't have enough to justify a I don't know where he was killed. <laughs> Come on, Harold, you're jumping. <laughs> God. You look dead. <laughs> Excuse the expression. Maybe. What's the button that gives me? Okay, okay. So, no. Not okay. So, okay. 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 So are these okay? Oh no, it's the victim. And this must be the sister. No, nope, that's the maid. Oh, that's the maid. Okay. So this is the sister because we haven't met her yet. So uh, the inverse yeah, ones are so. people we haven't met. Haven't met. So okay. What's this? Okay. What is that? Uh. That's a great question. And none of these say like. I mean, unless this is where he was killed, that doesn't make any sense. He wouldn't have been killed no. at the Har Carringtons. No. Oh, his name. <laughs> this dude's oh. name is David Canville. Hi, David Canville. Hi, David Canville. Well, our numbers went up. 
Uh, yeah, I guess. That's gotta be good. You mean to tell me that you don't know who the murderer is? I don't even know where he was killed! at this pace, people are going to lose confidence in Solve this case soon, or there are going to be angry folks knocking down our doors. Alright, jeez. Um, I guess we just go down the list until we find a crime sure. scene. <laughs> Welcome. Sorry, the boss isn't here, but maybe the general manager can help you. Please step this way. If I could step that way, I wouldn't need to see the general manager. Whoa, this guy. Wow, look at his forehead. Yeah. Not to body shame, but look at his forehead. <laughs> he's like a, I don't know, he's like terrible video game uh, uh, Conan O'Brien. Yeah, he's got the crazy eye. Well, detective, what is it? <laughs> I was hoping you knew something about anything. Yeah. Michael Holden, 30 years old, 30 years old. I'm the general manager here. I have type A blood. My father, Tony, my mother, and my wife, Kate. I'm really into my stamp collection, <laughs> and I read a lot. My mushroom stamp collection. <laughs> the moin of the lawn to me. What? Is that a euphemism? I was born in Ohio. I'm okay. a member okay. of the White Hawk. Aha! Okay. So you ride horses with Fred. We went to college together. He's a nice guy, but he lacks confidence. What he needs is a good woman. I think he's got his eye on someone. You know that dating ritual how you like somebody uh -huh. and you tear out your eyeball and you put it on them? Yeah, I... I, uh... Yes, <laughs> and... <laughs> he was a bit overbearing, but you could really count on him. Do you know where he was killed? <laughs> I kind of would like to see a crime scene. I was at home. As soon as I finish work, I always go straight home. I'm real dull that way. I can't think of anything else worth telling you. Just do your best. Kate has been really upset over this. It's a horse riding club. Bill used to be president. We were going to call it the Red Rum Club. Are but you kidding me? To uh, it with the old Red Tie Club. Uh, there's so much to unpack there. Wait a minute. This the name of this game is literally Murder, Murder club. club. Yep. <laughs> What if the game was named Ted Johnson Did It? <laughs> it's a horse riding club. No, I want. Oh, uh, how do I. Eh. Okay. Anybody else who work here? No? Okay. Can we go to the White. White, White, Hawk. White Hawk Club? I, guess, I don't know. Nobody's told us not. where it is, huh? Come in, Officer Harold. Thank you for your effort. Hello. How can I be of help? Tell me something. Martha Carrington. I'm 45 years old. I'm a freelance interior designer. <laughs> I just go into people's houses and move the furniture around. <laughs> a. That would be the best job, though. My husband, Joe, my son, Ralph, and my daughter, Janet. Gardening. Mm. I have a magnificent rose garden. <laughs> That's also a euphemism. I have some artistic ability. 
I was born in Boston. I've been living here for five years now. I don't belong to any club. I fired it on your car. <laughs> what? <laughs> She's from Boston. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> also, she farted on our car. Oh, no. <laughs> what can you say about a tragedy like that? You could say where he was killed. <laughs> He's a kind man, even though he suffering through his own loss. He's shown such concern for Janet's welfare. Yep. Bill's brother? Bill's brother? Bill's brother? Yeah. Bill's yes. brother? <laughs> She's a thoughtful woman. She helped with so many of Janet's wedding arrangements. I've never even talked to him. I don't remember who that is. Oh, that's the guy that runs the company the that Fred guy. works at? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. He's working today. My husband operates the home estate agency downtown. Uh, Janet. After Bill was killed, Janet came home. She needs the support of her family now. I just wish there were more we could do for her. It breaks my heart to see her suffering this way. I wish she'd picked a different way to suffer. <laughs> so thoughtless. Uh... I was home all evening. My husband came in at about 11 o'clock. Aha! Uh -huh. Red tie club. No, it doesn't mean anything to me. No, nothing at all. Oh, all these people oh. are here. Yeah. Whoa, is that... <laughs> is that Janet's dad? I think it's Janet's brother, maybe. Yeah. What's up? Yeah, it I must hope. be. Ralph Carrington. I'm 21 okay. years old. Okay, yeah. Okay, Hopefully. okay, good, good. I go to Hoolington College. A.B. Ab. I live with my parents. <laughs> I have a sister, Janet. I don't know. I like doing lots of things. I'm a great third baseman. I play for Hoolington College. I was born in Boston. <laughs> what is your native place? I belong to the school site club. Ooh, do you want to solve this case? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, in fact, I'm doing my, uh, I'm doing my final exam on criminal behavior right now. I've chosen a minor in murder. Oops, I've <laughs> said too much. <laughs> to be honest, I hated his guy. Uh-oh. The guy was a dirtbag. Still, I wouldn't wish death on anyone. Bill was a dirtbag. Except that guy. Yeah, I guess Bill was a dirtbag. Why are you asking me this? I didn't do anything. I went out with my friends, and I got home pretty late. No. 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 I don't know anything about that. What? I said hello. <laughs> what? Hello? Hello? What? 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 <laughs> Janet Robin. I'm 21. Before I Are got they married, twins? I worked for my father. A. Hey. Hey. I hey. used to have a husband. Now I'm left with a father, mother, <laughs> and brother. Things I like to do? At the moment, there aren't any. None. <laughs> I was born in Boston. I belong to the Anemone Club. The what now? The Anemone Club? <laughs> That's where we do, we make enemies. <laughs> oh, I see. I don't want to talk about Bill right now. I just can't handle it. Uh... We never really got together much. Why? 
Ralph and I are twins. Oh, you were right. Uh -huh. You solved it, Jenny. Ever since Yay, baby, it's always twins. That's why he resented it when I decided to marry Bill. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh, this guy named after a murder mystery author. He's a friend author. of my father-in-law. These are earrings? Really? I've got dozens of pairs. I was asking about these specific earrings. Thing of the bobs? I got twenty. <laughs> so handsome and nice and mature. Before I knew it, I was in love with him. I was so sure we'd be together forever. Until I murdered him. <laughs> what do you mean? What sort of thing? Like, where was he killed? I was home all that night. I tried to wait up for Bill, but I must have dozed off. I was woken up by a phone call from the police, telling me that my husband where, had been murdered. Where? Where did they say? <laughs> <laughs> well, it wasn't at his house, so yeah. now we know that. Alright, smell you losers later. How long have we been doing this? I got another few minutes, I guess. Uh, okay. Hitting the trail again. Home estate agency. Where? Who was? Who told us about that? I don't know. Hungry fisherman. I don't Hungry know what that fisherman. is. Okay, so anything that the the crime scene must be one of the ones that started out here in this menu, uh, right? Oh, probably. So, so uh, what were the uh, ones we started out with? I guess the fish hungry fisherman was is hungry that like fisherman. a restaurant? Was he murdered it's at a, uh -huh. Oh, where, where he was, the, last, he was last, seen. last seen. Okay. That's not That's exactly not quite, the but same. It's closer. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Are we he, sure he was murdered and isn't just gone? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he was stabbed many times. Yeah. Somewhere. How do we know? Where is he? <laughs> uh, there was a typewriter. Paul Davis. Paul Davis. Paul Davis. Paul Davis. <laughs> Paul Davis. Paul Davis. Paul Davis. I'm 38. I'm 38. <laughs> I've had this place for 10 years now. My blood type is uh, O. Do we want to venture where we think he's from? <laughs> my wife and my daughter. I like to fish. That's why I named this place the Hungry Fisherman. We don't actually serve fish. Fish. <laughs> I have a degree from the Roberts School of Cuisine. I'm from New Orleans. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I was going to say Louisiana. <laughs> I'm a member of the Association of Restaurant Owners. Bill was in a very good mood that night. What? Oh, he was all alone. I still can't believe he was killed. How? Where? He was here at least twice. No, not with his brother. By himself. Sure, I know him. Before his sister's uh -oh. wedding, uh -oh. he had a quarrel with Bill right here in the restaurant. We seemed convinced that Bill would hurt Janet somehow. Mm. I feel like uh, Ralph is being set up as the obvious but wrong solution. But wrong, yep, yep, yep. Yep. Whatever, where were you? I was in the restaurant the whole evening. No. I didn't go out at all until I closed the place at 2 in the morning. I went straight home after work. Now that you mention it, that night when I was closing up, I saw Stanley in front of the restaurant. Uh -huh. Aha! Okay, who's, who's Stanley? Surprised. I wondered what he was doing there so late. Oh my god, do we have a lead? We might have a lead. Why is it? Why are? Why is it giving us Red Tie Club? Why do we give a shit about the Red Tie Club red tie instead club. of the the White yeah. White Hawk the White, or Hawk white club. Horse Club? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. The Red Tie Club is just the club that 
That's just like, that was the club that already existed that had a similar name, so we didn't name our club that. Yeah. But why do we need to ask anybody about that? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know either, buddy. <laughs> Let's ask him about the it concept happens. of marriage. Sarah doesn't like to talk about it, so please don't bring it up unless you absolutely Oh, to. does she work here? Oh, maybe she works there. Or just a regular married Or maybe couple. she's his wife? I, uh... I don't know. I don't know. My wife and my or daughter. his daughter. Huh. <laughs> well, uh... Ah. Oh. Tell us about your rape! What oh, do you want to talk about? What do you want to talk about? There are, are you shields. a character on the television show Blossom? How old do I look? <laughs> Wrong! Wrong! 24 years old. Psych! Play the piano for all the drunks who come to this place. Today it's Type B, but who knows what it'll be tomorrow. Uh, I think it's still gonna be B. There's no one. <laughs> I'm all alone. Oh, are you? Okay, so she's just the piano player here? I guess, yeah. I like to be by myself. I don't like to talk with cops. Not liking to talk with cops is not a hobby, ma'am. <laughs> Apart from playing the piano, I don't have any. I was born in California. The sassy None. part of California. None. <laughs> His murder goes to show that you can't predict anyone's fate. The night he was killed, he came here alone. But he often came with a woman with long blonde hair. Oh. oh! Have we met anyone with long blonde hair? Long hair. Um, His wife's hair didn't seem particularly long. Yeah. I don't know him. He's been here a couple of times. Don't know him. Do we ask about Janet? She's been here before. She looks like a gentle person. The kind of person who wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> but trust me, beneath the surface is a woman capable of anything. Huh. Okay. okay. I don't know what you're basing that on. Who was All it? Right. Was it Stanley Howard, the, the dude just yeah. accused? Yeah. He's saw... always putting on an act. Probably why he gets upset whenever somebody upstages him. Hi, Katie. The night the murder took place, he was here, trying to pick a fight with Bill Robbins. I think he mentioned that he lives uptown. Mm -hmm. No, I'm not planning to get married right now. Business is it of yours? <laughs> well, do we ask her? I don't want to. <laughs> okay. That night I heard Bill mumble Liberty something or other. Maybe he was referring to the bank. Hmm. Sorry. Liberty something or I other. I usually drop earrings in married <laughs> men's bedrooms. Not usually. <laughs> Just I was sometimes. I all evening. I left at about two in the morning. I gotta say, this town has a restaurant that's open real late, and that's nice. Yeah? Yeah. 2 a.m. is a pretty good, uh... Tell me yeah. about Stanley Howard? Stanley's not a bad guy, but he has a tendency to get on people's nerves. <laughs> he and Mr. Robbins... Sorry, I tried to mute my something. mic there, and it didn't work. What? 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 I don't, even, oh, dang it. I don't even know what time Bill was killed. Yeah. I think that that would be an option back at Police HQ. Yeah, right? <laughs> Just like, where on earth did Bill Robbins go after he left here? You ask yourself on the way out. I sure, I'd like to know yes. that. Yeah. <laughs> Just you know, the basic final destination. Uh -huh, be, uh -huh. uh... I assume they found him somewhere. <laughs> yeah. Mm, can we go?
go to yeah, we can go talk to yeah. Howard. Howard. Stanley Howard. Stanley Howard. Never trust a man with two first two names. Two first names. Yep. Yep. What do you want? What's this all about? What's this all about? What's this all about? What's this all about? <laughs> Danley Howard. I'm 34 years old. I don't buy that. I'm a novelist. You must have heard of my book. Nope. Disco Inferno. Dancing with the Devil in the Pale Moonlight. <laughs> Quite a That's the know. worst title I've That's, ever heard. It's not good. It's too long. And yeah. I live by myself and I like it that way. <laughs> I live by myself and I like it that way. I like to drive. It's how I relieve stress. The ability to meet my deadline, no matter what I have to do to get the job done. Even if the job is murder. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't like it. Too noisy, too crowded. Too it's crowded. To right here. I've been living too in noisy. Three years now. I belong to the American Writers Group. I have nothing to say that would be worth your time <laughs> or mine. Yeah, it's true that we've talked a couple of times over at the Hungry talked. Fisherman, but that's about talked. it. Talked. I like how everybody's accent has a tang of Fargo in it. <laughs> uh... I think that Bill Robbins had a thing for her. He always went out of his way to be nice to her. I don't know anything about her. What's your alibi? I went to the hunting fisherman for a few drinks, and then I went straight mm. home to my apartment. Mm. Mm-hmm. No, mm -hmm. nothing in particular. I don't remember hearing about it. Not really something I'm proud of, but my wife ran out on it. With my being an artist, you know, our lifestyles just didn't match. Well, uh... She liked guys who weren't abrasive. <laughs> yeah. And I liked blunts. <laughs> she liked... She liked not book writers. <laughs> she liked men who weren't me. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, that's a, that's a, a place to, to okay. stop this episode. <laughs> so, yes. Uh, All right. Th thanks for watching, everybody, and I guess yes. we'll we'll keep seeing what happens with this. I think maybe yeah. we, between episodes we should probably like look up where the crime scene is. Or oh something. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good. <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah. All right. See you. See you later, everybody. All right. Tune in next time. <laughs>